Just 20 minutes south of North Carolina's capital city is a place that comes with two historic downtowns and a variety of things to do and places to visit, all while being one of the most mispronounced towns in the state. Without a doubt, Fuquay Varina truly is a dash more. You'll find many reasons to visit, and speaking from personal experience, you might even get the itch to move here. The town, also referred to as the Quay, has an incredible history and it's seen tremendous growth over the years. Built on farming and tobacco, it's been one of the fastest growing towns in North Carolina, fueled by its proximity to Raleigh and RTP. In 1985, there were nearly 3,800 residents. Today, there are more than 30,000 smart, fun, creative, and ambitious people who are passionate about calling this their home and being in a place that offers a dash more. The hyphenated name validates that this was once two separate small neighboring towns. You see, prior to 1963, there was Fuquay Springs and Verena. But let's travel back a bit further where it all started in the 1800s. First known as Piney Woods, the town acquired its unique names from history. The first families in the area included the Burtz, Joneses, and Rollins, but part of the name came from the Fuquay family. A French veteran of the Revolutionary War named William Fuquay moved his family here after purchasing 1,000 acres of Jones land in 1805. In 1858, while working the fields, William's son Stephen Fuquay uncovered a mineral spring that was believed to have healing powers. Word began to spread and locals and folks from neighboring communities came to visit, and eventually visitors came from far and wide. Taking the waters became an attraction for people of all types and with all kinds of physical ailments, leading to annual celebrations such as Easter Monday and the 4th of July. Evening glow excursions were offered at the springs and the town quickly turned into a popular vacation spot. The resort town of Fuquay Springs developed around this site and it was incorporated in 1909. Meanwhile, during the War for Southern Independence, a young soldier named J.D. Valentine, who was born just south of the spring, had received letters from one of many Southern ladies who wrote to troops to boost morale. Virginia, who originally signed her name Verena, would eventually meet Valentine in person. Of course, they fell in love and they got married and he continued to call her Verena throughout their entire life. When he became the first postmaster at the new post office in 1880, he named it Verena in her honor, as well as the general store across from the Mineral Spring. When two timber rail lines crossed nearby, Verena Station was born. A community grew south of the springs and in time it adopted the same name. Ballantyne's business success allowed him to construct the Ballantyne Spence House in 1910, the first house to have plumbing and electricity in the area. During the 1900s, the towns continued to grow with many additions, including banks, distribution centers, and other businesses, many tobacco-related. And Fuquay Springs and Verena had become significant trade centers for Southern Wake County. As travel became easier, the town saw less visitors, but the tobacco business really kept on driving the economy. The shared emphasis on agricultural and industrial growth brought the towns to a shared vision, and the towns merged into Fuquay Varina in 1963. You can visit the springs and where it all started in a little park given to the town in 1998. Among the springs and throughout town, especially the two historic districts, You'll find a variety of things to do and places to visit. There are a ton of shops and places to eat at, and you'll have a hard time not finding something you might like. Not to mention if you like beer, you won't be disappointed with what the Quay has to offer. While this little town started back in the 1800s all because of a magical mineral spring, today it remains a rewarding destination for those looking for a day trip adventure, weekend getaway, or a long-lasting home. Fuquay Verena really is a dash more.